All right, so as you can see again, I'm leaving a little bit of enamel at that base. Kind of see where all these wires are. Uh, if you don't leave enough enamel at the base, all these wires here are gonna short out and touch. And as you can see, I am twisting together my fifth live wire. All right, I have five, one, two, three, four, five live wires for the second channel. As you can see, none of my lower paired wires for the other channel are beeping and that you don't want them to beep. If they beep, you have a problem. And as you can see, I have no more wires on the left side and one more wire on the right side. Can anyone tell me what that wire on the right side is? Well, after your one, two, three, four, five pairs, your sixth beep, which will be your last beep on the second channel because you're out of wires, is your negative and positive to power this second channel. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my negative lead off that wire, that's my ne negative ground, and this is my positive to activate this second channel with frequency, signal, and voltage. I'm just gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna put it behind all these paired wires. Now we have, this is the fun part. 